Even if you're not a baker, it could be fun to watch on TV. There are lots of good shows to choose from Joanna Gaines Silo's Baking Competition. That's one of the newest, and the first season has a North Dakota connection. A Bismarck woman was one of five to compete in the Silo's season finale. Jody Kurzman has more. If you're looking for Jess Juma, there's a good chance you'll find her in the kitchen. Baking is my passion. Baking is what landed her on Joanna Gaines's Silos Baking Competition. Oh, that's exciting. I am a competitor at heart. Were you keeping that chocolate drizzle a secret from us? Us North Dakotans, you know, we're secretive like that. Jess whipped up her famous peanut butter cupcakes for the first round. It was a peanut butter cupcake with a chocolate frosting filling and then a peanut butter top. They were good enough to secure the win. I was shocked. <laughs> I really was. Everybody I baked with was so awesome and nobody had any big hiccups. That win meant Jess got to return for the finale. This time she baked a yeast roll. The challenge? making that in the two hours allowed for the competition. I tweaked the recipe, turned it into a single rise. I had to even create a outdoor proofing area because it's all filmed outside. What you see on the show, it, you are outside in the middle of Texas in October, and I baked a roll in two hours. I actually call it a roll muffin, the tweak. Um, so it's a roll made in a muffin container so it was easier to like take and go. It wasn't enough to win the competition, but Jess says that's okay. It really wasn't disappointing because I felt like I went in there to show my skills and the feedback I got from the judges was so amazing. Like that was better than any actual win, um, more than anything else. All of that making this experience pretty sweet. In Bismarck, I'm Jody Kurzman reporting for your news leader. You can find Jess's episodes on the Magnolia Network or on Max and Discovery Plus. Jess says she'd love to compete in another baking show someday. In the meantime, she'll stay busy with her home baking business. You can learn more about that on her website and social media pages.